This Brightline construction update looks at the progress at Orlando International Airport. Located southeast of downtown Orlando, Orlando International Airport will be home to Brightline's Orlando Station. We'll drive through the airport on Jeff Fuca Boulevard. We'll start on the south end, going past the future station in the intermodal terminal and under taxiways F and E. It is worth noting again that the track has been laid south of the station that will initially go to the vehicle maintenance facility and will eventually become the main line to Disney and Tampa. This is the intermodal terminal building, inside of which the station will be located. This terminal will provide connections to multiple forms of transportation, as well as providing a link to the airport's main terminal and the future Terminal C. Here is some track laying equipment next to the underpass under Jeff Fuca Boulevard. Two tracks have been laid through here and in the trench under taxiways F and E. Bass has been spread on them as well. Due to the low clearance under the taxiways, the tracks had to be dropped using the trunch. We are now entering the heart of the airport near the main terminal where the tracks will pass air sides 4 and 2. Both tracks are fully built through here. That is the Terminal C Automated People Mover on the raised guideway. Next to the APM for Airside 4, the underpass for baggage carts to pass under Brightline's tracks is officially open. The old path has been demolished and both tracks have been built across it. The tracks stop just short of the Airside 2 baggage car underpass. It is currently being finished and is more complex than the Airside 4 one as it also has another secure access road passing underneath. The crossover here has been assembled. We are now at the north end of the airport where the tracks will pass under Taxiway J and Cargo Road before turning east to head for Coco, passing through the Goldenrod Tunnel in the process. Tracks have also been laid here under Taxiway J. They end just short of the Goldenrod Road underpass. This new ramp will provide access to Cargo Road and will open in late September 2021. Here's a look at the Cargo Road underpass, which is getting close to being complete. The ramp I am on now that currently provides access to Cargo Road will be permanently closed in late September 2021 to make way for the tracks. This short bridge over a drainage canal is close to being finished, with the deck formed and the walls close to being finished.
The tracks will begin their turn east toward Coco here. The wall separates the right-of-way from the roadway. The work between the wall and the road is not related to Brightline, rather it is part of a State Road 528 road widening project. Some signal equipment has been installed along here. Here's a look down the right-of-way, as seen from atop the Goldenrod Tunnel. And here's a look east toward Narcusi Road. The tracks enter a slight trench here under the approach for runway 17L, the necessity of which is shown as this American Airlines flight passes overhead to land. Thanks for watching. Be sure to the like button and subscribe. Also check out my social media pages.